My son is in San Diego State right now, and my daughter is getting ready to graduate uh, high school. So it, the, the funny thing is, is that the whole family says, well, you two can study together, and honestly, we have. Victoria Bradbury started working toward an associate's degree at Mesa College five years ago after going through a divorce. I knew what I was going to do for the rest of my life, and then all of a sudden, you just don't know anymore. And uh, I just always wanted to help people, and I thought that I wanted to do something in healthcare. In her second year, Bradbury learned Mesa would soon offer bachelor's degrees in her field. State lawmakers approved a pilot in 2014 to let some community colleges offer four-year degrees. And the rest is history. I haven't looked back and um, I've done really well in all the classes. I graduated with high honors in the associate's program and I'll be graduating with high honors in the bachelor's program. Now Bradbury is eligible to rise through the ranks at her current employer, Sharp Home Health, and potentially make as much as $140,000, something that will help her pay for her son's tuition and soon her daughter's. Meanwhile, colleges are lobbying lawmakers to extend the pilot, otherwise it would end in 2023. Bradbury tells lawmakers... They really need to take this issue seriously because the the gift that I was given by being able to attend this bachelor's program um, at, for one at the cost plus the phenomenal faculty that are here, it's priceless. So it's something that it gives a lot of people like myself the opportunity to be able to not have a huge debt when I'm finished and to be able to support the rest of my family. The program costs $10,500 compared to more than double that at the CSU. Miracosta College in Oceanside is also offering a bachelor's degree and expects to have its first graduates next year. Megan Burks, KPBS News.